come out on the river. Um, this is the West Virginia shoreline here. Um, I'm at a different spot now. But a few hours ago, I walked up on and flipped out one of the finest points you'll ever see found. Especially on this channel, it's one of the top points. The closest is real good, and I found some bevels and stuff that are outstanding. But this point is about as fine as a chip point, and it's made out of a scarce material, Crooksville Church. Wait till you see this. But I'll uh, buzz over here and give you a shot of this short one. The water's just now down to where it's manageable, and I can really start probably finding stuff. You can see how high this bank is. It's 25 feet high, so every Indian over a 10,000 plus year old or a year period, those layers are just falling out all that time and laying on the beaches of the river where it's high like this. But I'm going to go up here and look and see if I can't find another point today. Um, and then I'm going to head home and check out this awesome point I found today. I appreciate everybody watching. It's a real cold day today here where I'm at. It's I saw when I looked at the weather forecast, it's the coldest weekend in the last 10 months. It's below freezing, but I feel great. It's not even, doesn't even affect me anymore. Unless it gets down under like five degrees, that's getting rough. But right in here is where I found that E-notch. That black little E-notch made out of a black canola shirt earlier this summer, right in here. But I'm gonna, it's still kind of high on this site, but there's gonna be places up here farther I can look real quick. See, there's potential. I'll talk to you guys later. All right, um, still at the river. There's some pretty fresh beaver cutting there. He's been chewing that tree down. I see lots of evidence down here. And I'm still looking. Later. All right, folks. Um, my kayak's right there. Um, I walked behind myself um, down river for 25 minutes again today. That close to my kayak, walking back, I saw I was looking this stuff. The water's dropped. The water was right here yesterday, but I've just got a serrated smoker. I flipped it out. I, I've just let me show you here real quick. It, it's just potential every piece of this flint that I'm flip, flipping out wasn't exposed yesterday within 24 hours in the water drop and I found this much and this is hematite right here um, it looks like it's rubbed and you see the red starting to come through but all of these flakes plus I got a few more in the other pocket a core um, no points yet but man this is probably going to beat the ones yesterday let me get this harness off this GoPro I keep this on me in case my get my thing tips over but it was laying right in here in this little wash and I flipped it. It's right here. Look at all this. This is all cracked up, ancient, close to 10,000 year old, early, early archaic campfire rock. It's mixed with river gravel here, but I found some nice ones. And look at this. It was right there. I flipped it out, saw flint, and this is looking good. Look at this. Let me wipe this off down here. It's got a real nice needle tip, it looks like. Oh, folks, this is probably the nicest serrated point I've found on my channel. Oh, my God, folks. Oh, this just makes me want to cry. This is what it's all about. This is a gym quality, just best of the best you'll see found. Look at the tip on this. This is top 10 of these of all time. You're seeing it right here, folks. This is an absolute smoking stein. Oh my goodness, folks. Oh, look at this. Just look at this. Oh, this is just a work of art. This just is a Christmas present. This just makes my December. It makes my Christmas. It makes my year. Wow, folks. I'll get up pictures and stuff, but man, I'm truly blessed. This is just a killer. <laughs> wow, folks. Wow. Well, anyway, folks, later. I had to give you one more shot of this bad boy. These points yesterday were nice, but it didn't compare to this. This is a 10,000 year old serrated point. Up, radiocarbon dates are 8,900 to 9,900, and it's an Amos corner notch, and it's about as good as you could ask for. And that's Crooksville Church. Um, that's how it looks when it patinates right out of sand and gravel like this. 
Wow, folks. Check that out. Right on a piece of Indian campfire rock and it came out right around it. Well, anyway, folks, that's a year maker. Later.